listen, I've been on our Let's uh, show for a while. I've been watching it for a while. And honestly, it's some of the funniest things that I've watched. Now, honestly, I would have reacted to some of her videos earlier, but their videos be like an hour plus long, bro. So it's like, I don't know if I can do it. This one is underneath it, right underneath the hour. So it's funny. We're going to see what goes. I usually like when the girls are on the line and the guys come out. That's my preference. But I also, let's see what the boys, what taste the boys have today. So don't forget to like this video. Uh, share with your mom and your sister, your daddy, your auntie, your grandmas, all of that. You feel me? And let's get into uh, Pop the Balloon or Find Love with Arlette. And we are here with another episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Love. And we've got some single men lined up. Make some noise, guys. Ooh, 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 oh, my God. <laughs> got <a dog> <laughs> okay, you guys. Okay, that's the energy we like. So we'll be bringing out some single women one by one. I hope we get some energy type, this episode. You like what you, you see, like, like what you hear. Up, Do not pop your balloon. However, if there's anything, you know, she says or anything on her you're not really feeling, go ahead and pop your balloon. And then I'll go over to each of you and see why you ended up popping. Are we ready? Oh, okay. Well, with that being said, let's go ahead and bring out our first single lady. Let me pause it real quick. Re reason why I like the ladies, though, is because, like, they come out and, like, you know, girls are a little bit more, I, wanna, I don't want to say mean, <laughs> but they're, like, you know, a little bit more um, less forgiving, and that makes for great content, unfortunately, but, you know, hopefully these guys can, like, bring the spark. My boy in the middle right here don't look like he's too confident. He's not even looking that way, you feel me? If we look at this lineup, you know what I'm saying? Bro on the right, <laughs> he just here to be here. <laughs> Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Andrea. Andrea, how old are you? I'm 30. And what do you do? I'm a dental office receptionist. Very cool. Uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? I'm probably the most basic person you're ever going to meet. <laughs> what I do for fun I like, is I like basic. being at home. I do love nature. <laughs> <laughs> I like taking walks. Um, I will go out on occasion, so all, I like comedy shows if we want to go out. Okay. Um, I want to get more into traveling, which is something I hope to do next year with some things I have working out for myself. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> but yeah, other than that, I whatever my person likes to do, honestly, okay. I'm pretty open. So nice. Now, speaking of your Instagram, person, bro. what are some things you look for? She's leaving with somebody. I am looking for a leader and my best friend mm. as far as all genuine what answers. I'm actually looking it. for in them as far as traits you mean yeah whatever it is what's something like when you're trying to find out oh, okay i think i like this person what are some traits you look for definitely um i'm looking for someone who is strong, i like our like so like, um, someone it's who has good character um someone who's disciplined someone who can motivate me and pick me up also someone who likes to have fun mm -hmm. someone who has empathy <laughs> i can go on <laughs> okay <laughs> now so, what like are some it. of your deal breakers Let's see. Mama. Deal breakers would be lack of affection. Mm. Um, I need we're dating in a relationship, whatever the case may be. Like I need you to show affection to me. I like yeah. to cuddle. I like to kiss. All of that. Um, and the answer she's giving me. Another I love one would probably be. <laughs> I would say if you just you're not growing as okay. a person. Yeah. All right. Cool. All right. So we did get a pop balloon. Okay. Let's go on over there. See why they ended up popping. Of course, it's bro. All right. Oh, it's not, oh, we bro can go ahead and start pop. with your name and age. I'm Ricky. I'm 32. Oh, and up, Ricky, region? what do you do? I'm a regional manager for a security company, and I work for Metro Valley for personal protection for the fair revenue team. I work two jobs. Nice, nice. Okay. <laughs> so why did you end up popping your balloon? Don't get me wrong. You're very beautiful. The attraction is there for me and everything. It's just you're a homebody, and it kind of seemed boring to me. Anyway, like so it's like, oh, I'm trying to figure it out. I'm new to this state and everything like that. Yeah. So I don't know what to do. You don't know what to do. We just gonna be bored together. And which is perfect. Like, imagine being bored in the house with your baby. How can you be bored in the house with your baby? There's, there should be never a boring time with your baby. It should all be full of love and affection. And and like, I'm I'm there and she there. I'm looking at her like. Mm, she a snack and we sitting there looking at each other and we can you can always find something to do at the house you feel me ain't nothing wrong with that it's because you want to go out it, and don't get me wrong like being outside is good too but like be just a night with your baby alone in the house people do you know how many people want that because maybe they have kids or they have other or they got to be at work or something but if you at the house and you just you know alone 
with your baby. That's understandable. Um, no, you were very beautiful. Like the attraction is there. So, but outside of that, that's just giving dole to me. Sorry about that. Dole was okay, crazy. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> so now is Ricky someone that's just anything but dole? No. Okay, and why not? I prefer a more seasoned man. So, what do you mean by what do you mean by seasoned? <laughs> ah, he's sassy. That looks he's a little sassy. older. Um, if you will, a little. He doesn't look immature, but I just like the more mature, somewhat put. Together, man, if you will, yeah. Okay. Not again, not that you're not, but it's just a certain type of look. I mean, just what the more. Mean, older. Not, not that you're not. Oh, oh respect the, that. Yeah. Respect, that. Him. respect that. Perfect. Thank you. Let's head on back. Oh, well, not that you're not. All That's right. What said about so you. we do still have five balloons left unpopped. Okay. I am gonna go ahead and have you ask these guys a question, just to help you narrow it down, see who's more of your type. Okay. Um, not what do you look for in a woman? Okay. Let's start over here with your name and age. Hey, how you doing? My name is Ishama. I'm 37. And Ishama, what do you do? I work in production and I also do photography as well. Okay. And if you want to just go ahead and answer her question, what do you look for in a woman? Uh, someone that's uh, cool, down to earth, um, like to go out, eat, um, travel, exercise. I'm not really a big exercise to, in my current state, but I love, I do like someone that's uh, motivated in that way where we could uh, also motivate each other as well, you know what I'm saying? Absolutely. So like someone to motivate me and um, also uh, someone that's just outgoing and just family oriented as well too. Yeah. So that's a big thing. Okay. Yeah. Well, thank Thanks. you. Let's go on over here. If we can start with your name and age. My name is Nelson, I'm 38 years old. And Nelson, what do you do? Manager for the United States Postal Service. Okay. okay. And now her question was, what are some things you look for in a woman? What I look for is uh, also my best friend, uh, a woman who's relentless, who's not going to give up on a relationship when things get hard and when we have a disagreement, a woman who's ambitious, uh, who wants to better herself, uh, humble and humorous as well. Okay. Nice. Straight to the point. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to our next guy here. Your name and age? I'm Cedric. I'm 32. And Cedric, what do you do? I work in sports. I work in media, and I'm a sports agent. Okay. okay. Very cool. Now, what do you look for in a woman? Um, just high quality woman, just someone who knows her mind, speaks her mind, um, just well mannered and put together. Okay. Okay. Let's go to our next guy. Your name and age? Trey. I'm 29. Trey, what do you do? Customer service rep for a door manufacturer. Okay. And what do you look for in a woman? Basically, like my best friend, somebody who's willing to work through problems and not just run out. You know what I'm saying, mm -hmm. pretty much just a well, well rounded woman. Okay. And let's go to our last guy here, your name and age. Yeah, my name is Timothy. I'm 37. Okay. Timothy, what do you do? Um, I'm an independent contractor and a professional day trader. Okay. And what do you look for in a woman? Uh, someone that's uh, open-minded. Timothy, bro, I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. This fit not hidden, bro. Bro got a sailor bucket hat, bro. First of all, I think that's tennis rackets on his helmet. On, <laughs> on his head. You got a track suit. <laughs> you got a track suit jacket with some jeans on. Flannel type shirt, bro. Button up with the cuffs, with the cuffs out. To the dating show, bro. Now don't get me wrong, swag is swag, bro. I, I'm, I'm, one, I'm one person that I, like I, I'm, a, I'm a person that likes to like, bro. Wear what you want to wear, but y'all can't lie, bro. Y'all can't sit here and lie, bro. Timothy dressed up like he going to to cast for Caillou Daddy. Like he going fishing, <laughs> he going fishing, a job interview, <laughs> and he about to hit the track right after on the same fit. Majority of people when she when uh, our leg gives the pin to pop, it's gonna be in. Trust me. Um. Also, who's it's willing to grow with me and help me problem solve, not just worry about you know challenges, but if there's something that comes up, kind of can work things together yeah. as a partner, as a team, pretty okay. much. Okay. Well, All right, okay. let's head on back. I know that was a lot of information, <laughs> a lot of information, but I am going to go ahead and hand you a pic because okay. it is time to pop some balloons. Watch, so, watch, I said it. Watch. I'll have if you hold don't, this. I'm going to be surprised. Maybe and she I'm going to have you pop two pop. balloons. Okay. Based off of what you see, what you've heard, whatever it is, go ahead and pop those two, and then we'll see why you popped. 
Yeah. <laughs> I can't ask another question, can I? Next round, yeah. Okay. Yep. <laughs> I figure. Let me just say, this is a lot harder when you're actually on the set versus. I bet. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> um, well, okay. She's going to make that walk of shame. I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, it won't. It's not going to pop. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. There we go. <laughs> okay, one more. Okay, I'll have you stay right there. We'll start over here. Okay, and Timothy. And why did you have your balloon unpopped? Oh, yeah, she's uh, very attractive. Um, I like the dress and everything. Um, didn't get enough information, but a date would probably, I wouldn't know a lot. And um, I don't Let's think I would have been able to You would have learned a lot from me. And I w it, it would have only took me one date. That was it. Okay. One date. And I would have won you on one date for sure. 100%. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so why did we end up popping his balloon? I would probably be interested in getting to know him, but I mean, this is, if we're being honest, it's just a show. So I have to go first off of physical appearance. Okay. Um, again, which isn't bad, but um, my type would be, you know, a more older, uh, seasoned man as far as, you know, the way he dresses and what have you. Um, just that more older, Usually, I don't mind. I mind this man in his early 30s, but it just has the look of like early 20s, if you will. That dress type. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank yes. you. Okay. And we did pop one more back here. This is gonna be a long day okay. for Timmy. And why did you have that. your balloon unpopped for her? Hopefully, there's somebody. Oh, yeah, she's an attractive young lady. You know, she looks nice. We're around the same age, so I understand. I get it. <laughs> she want an older man. So. Oh yeah. <laughs> so, you know how this go. Yeah. All right. So why did we end up popping his? Um, same thing, you know, like I said, for, sorry for going off physical first. Um, just not my first preference. That's all. Yeah. I guarantee you, bro, Thank if you there were dressed better, back. like a tiny bit better. All company, right. So we do have three remaining guys. Let's go ahead and ask them another question. Okay. I probably should have asked this first. Um, how do you feel about a woman with children? Okay. Start over here. I got kids too, so. Ain't nothing wrong with kids, really bro. With a chicken but way. you know, it's fine. <laughs> Looking, okay. looking at it from a here. person who don't have kids, it's like you yeah, no problem with that. I have kids myself. Right? We'll be but a whole honestly, bunch. The woman but, uh, is worth it. I got a question for you, though. She's worth it. Yeah, like baby, daddy, drop. You want, I do not. Okay. No, sir. Beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let's go over here. Like you, okay. you like her mm -hmm. I don't have any myself, but I would not get. Yeah, I'm fine. For one, anything over one, probably no. Okay. Okay. Now, how many kids do you have? Two little ones. Okay. <laughs> Understandable. <laughs> All right, so he did end up popping over the kids, but is okay. he someone that's your type? No. Okay, and why not? Uh, same thing, just uh, first preference. That's so. all. Okay, okay. He's a little shy. So you did have your balloon unpop for her for quite some time until you heard she has more than one kid. Um, why so? That is the only reason. No, I mean, like, why did you have it unpop before that? <laughs> she's very attractive. Um, other than more than one, one kid, she's perfect <laughs> in my eyes. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. All right. And we did get a pop back here. Okay. We'll be back for you. Why do we end up popping? Um, you're beautiful. Thank you. Hair is fire, all of that stuff. But I mean, I'm very, I'm visual as hell. Mm -hmm. And like the nails, yes. I didn't care for it so much. Mm -hmm. Plus like the, I'm not really a fan of the fit too much. But okay. you are, again, gorgeous as well, too. I but appreciate it. No turn down the that. The fit is fine to me. Sorry. No worries. It's okay. Thank you. Yeah. Now, is he someone that's your type? Why do people, why do, especially yeah. men, why, why do we yeah. care about that? If, like, yeah. thank uh, you. Uh, thank you. Know, he has a sweet, for, uh, friendly face. <laughs> I understand it's, like, looking feminine <laughs> and shit like that, but it's, like, All right, so we do have one unpopped balloon. Let's head on over there. Okay, any questions for our lady here? I do. I do. Um, I know everyone here popped their balloon. Fabio. So, let's be honest here. So. Who would, uh, out of these gentlemen, was your first choice? That's crazy. Based off of what? Based off of looks. Wow. She said you? Okay. <laughs> like, that, that, okay. I have to answer this, don't I? I'm just being honest. Yeah. Um, I'll be 100% honest. Yeah. It would have been you. Oh. oh. Yeah. Okay. I would have been like. <laughs> All right. And, and why is that? Okay, if I may ask. Say less. You fit my type. Oh. I like your facial features. I like yeah. the way you dress. You're okay. confident. But also, you don't need to be loud. You yeah, know yeah. what I mean? So, yeah. I, I could like be that. loud. I know you <laughs> but, uh, can. Um, <laughs> I, I, I do have another question, though. Um, sure. Do you want more kids? I'm content with my two, and I would love more kids either way. Okay. Yeah, right. either way. 
All right, let Jasmine? me come on up, come on up, come on up. <laughs> okay, so I have a final question, unless you guys have any others. Oh, and uh, uh, where do you live at? Kansas City. I feel like Fabio's gonna end up popping. Chiefs fan? Depends. <laughs> Depends, right? Depends on who you ask. How do you, I live in the Bay Area. So how do you feel about flying to the Bay? Because, I, I mean, I have no problem flying over there. So. I said I'm down to travel. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Especially for the right person. <laughs> All right. Perfect. Sounds good. Okay. So then is it going to be a yes for you for her? Uh, yes, ma'am. All right. And is it a yes for you for him? Yes. We got a man. That's what I like to see. Uh, <laughs> I'll take this I'll mic. But I knew she was going to get picked off. Let's she, give it up for them. She gives off good energy. You know what I'm saying? Good energy. Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. <laughs> the church shoe too, bro. Bro, you want to go to church? Hello, Fishing, welcome track. in. I'll have you take that. What's your name? Damn, Timmy. Uh, Brianna. Damn. Brianna? Mm -hmm. Damn. How old are you? I'm 29. Nah. What do you do? I saw that one episode of that one dude that walked in and it was just like pop, 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 pop. It was like gunshots. Imagine like you just walking in and, it <laughs> and it's pop, 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 pop. Like, you know, how would you feel? Like, how? I, like, I, I'm like, damn, what's going through their mind? How would they really feel? You know what I'm saying? You you just walk in, it's just pop, 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 pop. Like, damn. And you know, it's because you, you haven't even spoke, right? So it's really just based off appearance of what they see in you. Um, I'm an entrepreneur. Okay. Do you have any businesses we can be on the lookout for? Why don't you pop off for right now? Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I'm a gamer, so I just more be to myself. Okay. Um, I'm a PC gamer, so I got like, I'm a gamer. That's all. Okay. <laughs> That's what I love to do for fun, to be honest. So. <laughs> all right. Um, and now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, a confident man, loyal. Um, I don't know. A man that really knows about himself, you know. Um, not really on career set, you know, just more of if he knows what he want to go for. Mm. Um, so, you know, just a confident man that knows how to treat a lady. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, what are some deal breakers? Uh, a felon. Um, like, I never, I never uh, understand, like, the people that pop off for the straight off appearance. I don't they know. A judgmental say. man. I don't like nobody like this judge. It's just all good for you. Know what I mean? Like, like you want a dating show. Let me at least hear out what she got to say. All right, so we dig in a few pop balloons. He's gone over there, see why they ended up popping. Like, All right, let's start here with your name and age. How you doing? Uh, my name is Ishama. I'm 37. Okay. And Ishama, why did you end up popping your balloon? I apologize. It was the tattoos that caught me. Saying? And I'm just not a mm -hmm. fan of too much oh, tattoos and stuff like that. I, even though I have tattoos myself, mm -hmm. it's just like, yeah, it was just a little too yeah, much. That wasn't, but that wasn't as real gorgeous as yourself. Thank you. Yeah. No so. problem. Mm -hmm. Now, is, is Ishama someone that's your type? You're not bad looking. Appreciate that. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to our next guy. Your name and age. Ricky, and I'm 32. Nice to meet you. And I Ricky, why did you end up popping your belly? Like First and foremost, oh. I couldn't get past the shoes. It's like they squeeze in your feet. It's like they suffocate. Uh, I just couldn't get past oh, that. Okay. Okay. Well, I mean, another thing, physical attraction just wasn't there for me. Mm -hmm. Like, what in my speed? Like, when I look at something, I want to be like, oh, I got to get that. Or right. I, I need that. And it's just right. like, oh, huh, next. So, like, the attraction wasn't there. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. So it's Ricky someone that's your type. Oh, he the one, uh, he the one this episode. Huh? You got a strong face. Oh, why you gotta be Ricky? I man? love it though. <laughs> you mean like his jawline? Is that what yeah. you mean strong? Oh, mm -hmm. okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> you should eat a lot more, but I love it. Thank you. Appreciate that. Mm -hmm. You are beautiful as well. Thank so you, I never okay. thought I wasn't. Mm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Let's go on over here to our next guy. That's your name and age. Trey, I'm 29. Hello. Trey, why did you end up popping your balloon? Kind of like what my boy said down there, just a neck tattoo. I don't really like it. So everything else is perfect, though. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Tattoos. Yeah. <laughs> I love them. They're my favorite part about me. Yeah. yeah. I'm breakable. Oh, is that what that says? <laughs> yes, it does. Oh, yeah. okay. You're cool, though. <laughs> Unbreakable throat is crazy. I'm going to lie. That turned me on, shoulder. She got that unbreakable neck. You can't break her neck. It's unbreakable. Like Ray J's glasses.
Okay, so he's cool. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Let's go over Timmy, here. Timmy, the first one. Your name and age. Timothy, I'm 37. Okay. Hi. And Timothy, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, just not attracted. I don't like the tattoos and the leg. Got a leg tattoo. Um, Aww. I just don't she see myself said, having oh, fun with you. Like okay. I want. I'm looking to have some fun. Right. And I uh, just. I don't know. Timmy, first of all, Timmy, first of all, she will pick you up, toss you in the air, and you'll fall down. You have the best time of your life with her, bro. You can't y'all see it, bro? If y'all look at them together, bro, you can just imagine that type of relationship where she's just like. She has him, and he and he's just there. Timmy, she, Timmy, that is your wife right there. You are looking at the one. And you was the first one to pop. You want to have some fun? You would have the most fun with her, bro. I'm telling you, bro. I'm telling you right now. Okay. And look, the weight, you're, you're kind of overweight for me. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So is Timothy someone that's your type? No, he looks his age. He does look like he's 37. It's okay, though. Okay. He's about 9, 10 years older than me. But I do. You, It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It's <laughs> good fact. So we do have one unpopped balloon. Right. Um, any questions for each other? Yeah, how many kids you got? I got three. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Kids obviously are a deal breaker. But before that, is she someone that's your type? Yeah, she look good. You know, I like the tattoos, uh, you know, that's what they look nice. Right? Yeah. Depending yeah. on how much you got, you know what I mean? I ain't gonna lie. Can't even lie to you. That's good. Mm -hmm. Now, is Cedric someone that's your type? No. How many kids you What makes him not your type? The way he looks. <laughs> I like the way she's coming. I'm not trying to be funny. He's just not my type. Not for oh. real. So, when you say the way he looks, like, his the face. outfit. Real, bro. And Arlette be trying to keep it professional. She knows she's trying to laugh. You're making me laugh. I'm trying to. I told you. laugh, laugh, bro. Yeah. Who, the last guy? Yeah. Why are you laughing at him? Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay. All right, well, that is all the balloons popped. But we do thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. I like it. Thank you. Yes. Feed me this. Go to the next. Look at TV. All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hello, welcome hey, in. What's your name? I'm Kay. Kay, how old are you? I'm 30. And what do you do? I am a fashion designer, a stylist, and I'm a toddler teacher. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Thanks. And uh, what are some things like to do for fun? Um, travel. Um. I'm a roller skater, okay. so yeah. <laughs> um, I like to draw. Honestly, no, I'm a gamer like girl, girl, so I, I like to play video no games no, when no, I am no, like in the house. Yeah, literally. Some, okay. some, some like that, <laughs> now, what are some things that. you look for in a man? But I want to pop because of that. Because someone that likes to travel, spontaneous. Um, you know I mean? Like to have fun. A little bit introverted because, like, we can go out, but. I, I don't want to go out like that. She got a tattoo. No, she got no, a tattoo. No. Stone, no. Well, why All right. pop and now, um, what are some of your deal breakers? I told you it wasn't a tattoo. My deal breakers are kind of like basic, but a lot of men like these. Okay. So um, communicative, chivalrous, spiritual, and uh, is in therapy or willing to go to therapy. I feel as though everyone needs therapy. Okay. So if you feel like you don't need therapy, baby. Don't come over here. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. So we have no pop balloons. You are doing great. So what that means is I'm actually going to go ahead and switch it on over to you. So I let me hand you a pick. Okay. I'll have you hold that. And for like, this like first round, I'm going to have you pop one balloon. Just based off of what you're blue. seeing. Whoever's not really your type, whatever it is. Maybe it's the outfit. I don't know. Go ahead and pop those balloons. Timmy, balloon, go ahead and get your balloon ready. Gonna pop in. Watch. Okay. <laughs> Timmy and Black Church. Um, yep. One and two. Go, Timmy. All right, let's start over here with your name and age. I'm Cedric. I'm 31. Okay. And Cedric, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Mm, she looks nice. She Thank looks you. Nice. <laughs> All right, and now why did we end up popping his balloon? Um, just the initial attraction. Okay. That's um, everybody. Answer. Yeah. Just initial attraction. Is there attraction. anything specific? Like, give, give us more juice. The outfit. No. If it's the outfit, guess who's next, Timmy? Thank you. Let's head on back. And for this next round, I'm going to have you ask oh, the guys a oh, question just to, just to help one. you narrow it down. 
Timmy's next. Okay, so what is one thing that your closest friends will say that is that you need to work on as far as friendship and a partnership? All right. Let's start over here with your name and age and the answer to her question. That was a tough one right there. Um, I'm Good. Ishama. I am 37. What's your name? Ishama. Ishama? Yeah. Okay, it's pretty. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, something my friends would tell me I need to work on. Me too. Would I'll probably have to pop probably those. Probably be like, like me reaching out if I need help or something like that. Because I'm usually like, <laughs> I could do so on my own. I could do so on my own. But nah. Sometimes I need to go out there and just ask for help She's on the vibe. Though, you know? Right. So okay. that's pretty much it. Now I'm looking at it. That's what she's <laughs> As far as that's friendship and partnership? Partnership. Yeah, oh, so friendship and partnership. Right partnership would be, oof. I don't know, man. Um, something my partner would probably want me to, my partner might ask me to do as well, too, is just like, again, probably reaching out or just, uh, I don't know. That's what, for me, I need to go back. I got to come back for that one. It's a okay. little tough one. <laughs> okay. It's a tough question. All right. Okay. Let's go to our next guy. <laughs> Your name and age and the answer to her question. I'm Ricky and I'm 32. Something I need to work on is a friendship that all my friends say, because all my friends are established, married, families and everything, and there's me. So I need to understand and work on that uh, I'm the single friend in life, so <laughs> I can't keep calling up Tim and him every day, like, hey, bro, let's do this. Yeah. He got a life, he got a family. I'm the single friend, too. It's and, okay. Which is what I'm trying to accomplish and be there one day. As a relationship, what I need to work on and understand is that I think a lot that I've learned is I'm my biggest downfall with that. Like the reason I don't have the relationship that I'm looking for and everything is because of what I'm liking. What I'm, you know, used to, I can't get that happily ever after mm -hmm. based on what I like and everything. So I need to realize my wants and needs and everything like that and get that. I need to go back to the drawing board and Just really have more hard, right? predictable or understandable it's just terms, really like, you know, when it comes to looking for a relationship like that, so just lower my expectations a little bit like that. I Maybe I find never <laughs> lower your expectations. <laughs> never good. lower them. If you want what you want, stick to it. Look, look it's, it's, it's kind of like sorry. It's kind of like it. looking for love in today's generation. It's like I'm looking for that old school love with modern. You're looking woman. for a four leaf clover. It's okay. Stick to it. Yeah, that, that, that's fine. But when it, I'm surrounded by gen z type of women mentality like these young women mentality change your environment mm. that's why i'm in arizona chicago <laughs> AZ. okay let's go to our next guy <laughs> your name and age and the answer to her question i'm trey i'm 29 she, um she, as far as friendship it. probably communicating like when needing help reaching out mm -hmm. um relationship wise probably expressing my feelings when before things get past dudes to where like i like should them express two together it right here at the but beginning yeah. I, I gotta do better with just expressing them at the beginning like, of the like, when I, when I feel them, letting that my like, look at your know. woman. Look at your other potential that, woman. Don't look at our lip. That would probably be the two main things out of. Okay. Thank you. It's going over here. Your name ah, is Timothy. Your question. Oh, yes, my name is Timothy. I'm 37. Um, as far as friendship, I would say um, they would probably want me to level up more, more like fina financially. And as a partnership, I would say probably be more affectionate. Pay attention to more detail with the woman. Timmy, you giving all the wrong answers, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. Oh, Timmy right. Hicks, Alfred. Not even, not even just because how he dressed. That answer was pure bad. Oh. That was a terrible answer. You wanna answer. ask something? Okay. All right, so, all right, so my thing is, I'm very picky in certain things, and I also, I expect a lot from my partner sometimes, and I think that could be a downfall for me. So, like, when I'm with that person, sometimes I could be a little picky sometimes with what she do or whatever might be the case, but I'm trying to work on that side of me. I'm a Virgo, so that's a part of me, so yeah. Just letting you know. <laughs> uh, she turned her head. <laughs> that's nice. Okay. All right, so I am going to have you pop one balloon. Based off She's of, you know, with Timmy, bro. Heard, whatever it is, go ahead and pop. Really? It's so soon. I know, I know. It's Timmy, bro. Why is she acting like it's a hard? Oh, what's the pop? I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You walk a shade. Um, you said just one? Just one. Oh, mm -hmm. wait okay. a minute. Um, pop papers. All right. So, why did we end up popping his balloon? His response, lack of affection. Um, I feel like.
Like, bro, like, Tim, bro. That was a terrible response, bro. Like, we knew he was gonna, he, we knew, like, we knew Timmy was gonna get popped, bro. It's like the least, like the last one for me, but I can be affectionate when it comes to my partner. So we both can't like those things. Mm -hmm. Like one of us have to want to give that part of us, you know? And then you said level up with your finances. I don't know what that looks like for you. Um, but for me, like finances is, isn't a big thing, but I'm a big person. And at one point, at some point, finances will be a big thing for me because of like who I am. I'm a designer, I'm a stylist. And like, so I'm up there, right? So like, I want at least us, I want us to be at the same level, if that makes sense. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, Um, I would say I've been told that before. So when I say pay attention to more detail, more like I may not be in that moment and you may want some affection I may not be there at the moment, but if I pay more attention to detail, I can pick up, okay, you want to be held or something like that. Jeez, just those, it's just those little things. It's not like, that's, I'm not doing nothing. It's just those little detail things I get. Oh my gosh, I get spanked bro. for pretty much. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Those little things will be big things. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. Like, that's bro, true. Answers are terrible. Thank bro. you. Okay. Let's go ahead and ask another question. Me? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> okay. Um, what is, what's the most spontaneous thing that you've done that you shouldn't have done, oh. but it was, it was fun? I can name a few. And you was just like, I'm never going to do that again, but it was fun. Mm. <laughs> Look, they're all thinking like, what? <laughs> okay. Oh, he's ready. Let's go to one that's already ready. Let's start right here. Blew somebody out on their period. Oh, what? <laughs> Never again. It, uh, was, it was fun. Did we you know that she was on her period? Oh, yeah, of course. I'm definitely checking with that. But then for me, it's like, okay, now I know you're on your period. What's going to look like if I change my flight now? Now it's going to look did like. Did you use protection? Did you use? No, we, we didn't do anything. I mean, we had a, the time. So was you had. wasted time and money. Oh, oh she did. No, I don't. Because why you fly her on the first place? See, but that's my thing. Cause like, it's a, a personal close friend of mine and everything tried to take it like that. But then, like I said, when I realized, oh, it ain't nothing happening. I don't care about having fun. So you wasted her time. How? She got a free trip. Yeah, but she came out. It don't matter if it's a free trip. She with you. What that mean? Or were you not spending time together? Yeah. Just everything she wanted. I dropped the bat, did everything. But it's like, like I said, that was something fun that I wouldn't do again. And you said that you, was fun. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun for who? For both of us. <laughs> okay, if you had fun, love, then so, that's all so, that matters. So in order for you to have fun and connect and to be with somebody like that, sex got to be involved. I didn't say sex. That's what your perception. I never said that. But I was. You said on her yes, period. You did. So you the first thought that came to everybody's mind was sex. So you said on her period. So you had some type of indication that you wanted to have sex with her right because mm. you said on her period who gets who out and not expect to get <laughs> me up exactly sex. so you saying you try to put that on me and say that my thought of like uh, having fun had to deal with sex <laughs> no you said period so if you're saying period then automatically i'm gonna say yeah because if you say i flew her out on her period i'm gonna yeah. be like okay he wanted to have sex with me <laughs> <laughs> Sir, yeah. There's nobody not going to fly. I like how real she is. want to fly dog to get to know you. We got FaceTime for that. Video <laughs> chat. Facebook. But it's, it's FaceTime and text messages is different when you're in person. Okay. It's a different type of energy. Let's go on to our next guy over here. All right. You can't argue with her. I'm not going to say Alex. I'm not, I wouldn't do it again. But um, I'm, I think this doing this in itself was just like spontaneous. Like mm -hmm. I got the call. I just came back from a trip. And I was like, hey, uh, would you like to come on the show? I was like, oh, shoot. And the crazy thing is I signed up for the show when I was on vacation. <laughs> wow. So it was insane. And I'm sorry if I'm letting out the cat out the back. But yeah. Um, you that were on was, vacation with someone? No, I was with my family. OK. I was Just, with my family. I had to ask. I got, I got, the, I got <laughs> I you. Now I was with the fam. So right, I, it was a bad vacation. Nah, it was a great vacation. Um, but um, that was just spontaneous to just come out here right after that. And I mean, would I? I would do it again, but it was definitely a good time. And it is a great time as I am. 
doing right now. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can tell one more guy. these men, they respect her. If that makes sense. She kind of like him, man. Join, like, um, being on the show right here is probably the most spontaneous thing recently. Because it's out of, like, you can't out of the her. box for me. So, I mean, I'm enjoying the experience right now so far. And hopefully it goes well at the end for me. Yeah. Okay. He's too reserved, mm-hmm. man. Let's head on back, her. and it is time to pop a the balloon. Don't like that, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool to be calm and collected. That's what we're saying. Relax. Cool. Hold on, hold on. Let's let her like pop. It, Let's let her pop. <laughs> you want to get pop? I like confidence, though. Okay. You tried it. Mm-hmm. He next, told you. Okay, let me squeeze right in. So why did we end up popping his? Live little, bro. Um, he said the same thing as him. So it wasn't really no authenticity. No confidence. It, That's what you want to yeah, say. Yeah. It you didn't set yourself up like outside the box for me. Okay. That was it. it was like you guys don't take no no fun trips. That's what I'm saying, bro. Little yeah, little I do, but tell it haven't been any recently. It don't have to be recent. It could be from ten years ago. I mean, losing money in Vegas. A couple months. Yeah. I mean, do that. You count? should have said that. Oh, I say, I mean, you didn't the most say that. Fun since then, I mean. If he yeah, would come out a little bit, I'm telling you to leave. You drive home. Yeah. 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 Like sad. You came, bro. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> never, never play with your winnings. Uh-huh. All right. So you we do have bro. two guys left. You got it. You guys, got any questions for our beautiful lady here? Okay, the second. Mentally, like, where are you at in your life right now? Like, space, are you working through some stuff? How's family My life? Already died, like just bro. your family as well too. Are you very family oriented or more or less? Uh, we not even halfway. A loner. Oh, you are. But one question. Okay. Yes, yes. It started off with one, but um, now it's three. How am I mentally yes. right now? Yeah. Um, what's the what's like the the number? Is it like a one to ten? No, or? just tell me I'm how like you real feel real like. Shit, bro. Mentally, like <laughs> not not a. Continue here. It's just like how do you feel? I feel great mentally, yeah. like. So I am a taller teacher, so that comes with a lot of stresses. Um, taller kids are, they're a handful, mm-hmm. they're two. <laughs> so like a lot of people like to say like terrible twos. Gotcha. I don't like to say that about my taller's, they're terrific twos, but some of them are terrible. Yellow. <laughs> yeah. Gotcha. But um, it's not that bad. My mental is pretty, pretty well. Gotcha. Um, I do do therapy. That's why I ask if that's like not ask, but that's one of my deal breakers willing or in therapy because therapy really helps. Mm-hmm. Um, just to talk to somebody that's unbiased because your friends are very biased about you. Um, so yeah, mentally I am a okay. What's your next question? Family. Like, uh, like, are you very family oriented? Like, I am family you, you're oriented. at the cookout every time you bring in the, the, the. If there is a cookout, yes, I am there. And gotcha. I'm sorry, DC, but I like Lizzie's. <laughs> <laughs> Lizzie's and hot dogs is on my plate. I mean, um, hamburgers is on my plate. So, yes, I am at the cookout when it comes to like, if my family is throwing a cookout, I'm gotcha. there. So, yeah, I'm very family oriented. I'm closer. I'm close to my brother and my sister. Right up. Cool. Okay. Thank you. Any questions here? Short and simple. I just want to know how many kids you got, if okay. you have any. I have one daughter. What about you? She has I have, have two one. boys. <laughs> okay. Um, same mother, different mother? Same mother. You Technically are... one by DNA, but I claim to. Okay. Um, previous, previously married. Never been married, engaged, none of that. How old are you? 32. Okay. That's not bad. All right. You said two boys? Two boys. Jay and JoJo, six and ten, nine. Okay, that's not bad. My daughter's six. Okay, perfect. Hey. Oh, we are down to two. It is time to pop one. She don't like her options, <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I know it's tough. They have some good responses. She don't like none of them. I'll be I honest know. with you. You gotta <laughs> pick. You gotta pick. I'll be with you. <laughs> oh man. Okay, um, I can't ask another question. Mm, no, go ahead and pick. Not just one. I don't know what she picked. Is it a quick I response or is it long-winded? It, never mind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she might go off a high I... But bro looks young though. I ain't gonna lie. Only because you had it out. You might as well put put, this time. put it out. Damn. <laughs> 
because you had it out. Your fault. There we go. <laughs> I like that one. All right. I know I saw it was really, really tough to pick between these two. So why did you end up popping his? They both had really great answers, to be honest. Yeah. Um, I just went with it because he already, you perceive, like, mm. your perception is your projection. So if you already thought that it was going to be you, then you already trying to put yourself out the game. It's not fair to you. It's a disservice to you. You're very handsome. You're very nice. I, I like, like your that, answers. Bro. But you try to put yourself out the game, and that wasn't fair to you. Okay. Yeah, so, and you saw I walked past <laughs> you. So don't do that again. Yeah. <laughs> not for me, but just for other <laughs> just for other people, don't do that to yourself okay. because you never know. Okay. Respect. Okay. Respect. Cool. Let's head on back. Let me bring you on up here. Let's scoot that way. She's going to ask another question. I don't think okay. Yes, bro. So, y'all got to know each other a little bit. Any final questions? Uh, Not really. I think I got everything she else. Okay. What about for yourself? Um, is it, a long, it has to be a long one. It can't be long winded. Ask your question. I know you want to ask it. Go ahead and ask. ask okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> sorry. What so do you either. do? I work in production. Camera operator. You live here? No. Where do you live? New York. Okay, great. <laughs> oh, I don't live in New York. I live in DC, but it's- I heard you say it earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I just said, so long distance isn't, isn't a problem for you. I mean, we can't know each other. Far. We can't know each other. That's not a problem. Okay, great. All right, so it sounds like that's it. So my final question, is it a yes for you for her? Yeah, most definitely. Uh, and is it a yes for you for him? Yes. We got wow. a man. I'll take this mic, like. and you guys can go on off. <laughs> Congrats. Let's give it up for them, y'all. Give it up, you give it up, one, give right? it up. I see the other one. She low key one right now. She was the best All one right, let's opinion. go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Let's see. Are they popping up? There's only four, bro. Timmy, I'm going to be honest, bro. Two of these men Ooh, might leave. Welcome Timmy in. The, Timmy in black What's your name? I don't know about them. My name is Alexis. And how old are you? I'm 29. All right, and what do you do? I'm a realtor. Okay, and Alexis, we did have you on the show before, and you actually did end up matching. So what happened? Um, it just didn't work out. Okay. So I'm back again, looking for love. Yes, welcome back. Now, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I really <laughs> like just enjoying life. You know, trying to have fun. Um, I like I traveling see? and to going honest, on vacation, things like that. Teal, Doing like arcades, amusement parks. Teal shirt. So. Okay. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Wait, um, someone going who's out honest going to go and has around. good communication. Someone who is a leader but also values my voice and my opinion. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, what are some deal breakers? Probably someone who's dishonest mm -hmm. or unloyal. Okay. And a... Uh, Someone who's too friendly. Ooh, <laughs> you like I'm a little mean to others, huh? <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> All right, so we have no hot well, So black, I'm going to go ahead and have you ask shirt. these guys a question. Black Just kind of help us narrow it down a little bit. Okay. Um, well, why are you guys here? Why did you sign up for Pop the Balloon? Because I'm trying to find love. Mm. Start right on over here. What you mean? Name an age and why did you That's sign up for Pop the Balloon? Ricky, 32. Dating pool got pee in it. That's to sum it up. It sucks out here in Arizona. Okay. Let's go to our next guy, name and age, and why are you here? I'm Cedric, I'm 31. Uh, I signed up because yeah, I'm looking for love and you know, a right woman and all that. I already got my own. Y'all gotta start so looking at the just looking for that, you, you know, match, get, perfect match, really. You looking at our way, bro, so our way not available. Name and age, and why are you on Pop the Balloon? On Trey, I'm 29. And I'm here because I'm looking for love. Try yeah, to try any uh, right. obstacle. Right. Figure this be a good option to try. Okay. And your name and age, and why are you on top? Trey was confident. Uh, my name is Timothy. I'm 37. I'm Timmy. here because to find love, and I think mind, having a strong relationship is probably Timmy, the missing piece of my life. Be for you, bro. Okay. Just not her, bro. Have you been here before? You look familiar. Uh, yeah, episode 15. Yes. Okay. Oh, Timmy was here before. <laughs> I must have missed that one. She said, Damn. I recognize that face. <laughs> All right, Alexis, so I'm going to hand you a pick. Let me get one for you. 
Damn. I ain't bought my I ain't bought my I swear I ain't bought one balloon based off of Damn. what you're seeing, what you've heard, whatever it may be, go ahead and pop that one. Okay. Damn. I swear I ain't popping. She going hold on, before she pop, bro, I swear she going black shirt of Timmy. Cause I told you it's really only two options. It's gonna be teal and do with chains. Telling you. But uh damn. Hey, I don't care who you leave with today. I'm available. I'm on these streets too. <laughs> I'm hungry too. And the more I look at her, the more I kinda like her. Um, you know, I can make you smile, I can make you laugh. I'm goofy, you know what I'm saying? I'm a hard worker. You know? <laughs> Black shirt, go ahead, bro. Timmy is going to be next after this. Damn. All right, so why did we end up popping his balloon? I'm just probably the physical. Damn. It's a little bit different from what I'm used to going. Like, but you seem like My a nice guy. Tight again. Like, <laughs> All right, Damn. and Cedric, why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? When she looks nice, she said she's a realtor, so, you know, it's all Man, like what she do, bro. She me. was nice, bro. That was it. Okay. All right. Thank you. Damn. So I like the hairstyle. Damn. Yeah. That's another question. Yeah. Okay. Um, Damn. Describe your perfect woman. You, baby. Damn. Okay. I think I like her. He's now, as far as her. like a woman, the the, the shorter right, hair describe girl your was, woman. was it? Like first time, <laughs> bro. Um, that's a really good question. I'm um, locked in. I would say first off, someone that's talented, um, someone that has good listening skills as much as I do. Um, me, someone who's definitely wanting to want to grow with me, not just not just be talking, because a lot of people jokers just be talking out here. They ain't, they're not really serious. Um, and someone that's kind of like want to be like but if she had to best be friend to hear, and a teammate. Oh my you man, know, you have your thing, I have my thing, like and then at times we come together be right, to be you know what I'm need, a perfect unit. Just need a little bit day. more confidence. Okay, I like that. <laughs> okay, that uh, answers your question. I guess my perfect woman would be like somebody I can, I guess, be my Look best friend, her, bro, somebody I can joke with, play with, uh, communicate with on my bad, bad days, good days. Um, Someone I know, that knows I have their back and they have my back, even on um, bad or good days. But just somebody who's willing to work with somebody, build a build a relationship, not use the other person to gain something that, more than the other person. That makes sense, Troy. Okay. <laughs> oh my right. God, bro! It 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 cuff. Thirty two. I think it the cuff. perfect woman for me is somebody who takes the time to understand me for me, because understand me is to know me. Somebody who respects me as a man, like as I will respect you as a woman and a partner. And most important, importantly to me, is somebody who's compatible. Because I think that's an overall look You see how he's looking at her in the eyes? And I think like, a lot of people, how, oh, you're attractive you, to me and everything, but you're, you're not, not compatible. Pop, so compatibility too. is a main thing for me because we're compatible. It's a lot of confidence. I don't feel like it's I can take her yeah. over. Okay. All right. Like Those are good responses, down. huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have you pop one balloon. Timmy, come on now. Get him up out of here, no, bro. It's getting harder now. I know, I know. Harder now. <laughs> like, like she, she ain't got Timmy on her mind to pop, bro. She going to Timmy, bro. Don't look at me like that, y'all. I'm looking at you like that. Where are they supposed to look? Looking at you. Where do you want them to look? look Not at, at me. <laughs> Damn, she kept Timmy. All right, so why did we end up popping his? I think I just like the other two answers. Because he's not confident, bro. Physical, like Trey, bro. More as well, so I'm sorry. Fine. Trey, and bro. So why did you have your balloon unpopped for her? She's, she's fine. definitely beautiful. Um, the physical attraction is there. The physical attraction is there. I think she's everything. Really there. Everything. The hat. The hat. We got to know each other, but. <laughs> Damn. Cool. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Let's head on back. Damn. And for our two the guys left. Any be questions for our beautiful lady here? Oh yeah, my okay, god. Let's head down over here. Okay, what's your question? Man, what's her um, name, man? So my question Maybe is, she said it already, what is life? What is what is doing life with the, what what is doing life with you like? Fun. Um, well, I think it's fun. Yeah. 
always trying to be positive. So definitely a lot of positive energy. Mm. Um, I'm the type yeah, to yeah, motivate you water. and always push you, you know, towards your dream and your goals as well. Woo. So okay. it's fun over here. I, I promise. Know it is. <laughs> I'm feeling that sounds pretty accurate. I can see that. I can do that. Take me move, bro. Go back. Damn. Okay. Any questions over here? Oh my God. Something easy. We in charge of date night, right? Where's the ideal date for you? What does that look like for you? I don't like that question. Um, well, Show definitely me, not like the movies or someplace like where we wouldn't talk during like, the date. Yeah, so let's probably talk, let's, let's you know, I mean, like going somewhere. A... Like, like I said, I like amusement parks and like, stuff like that arcade. So somewhere where we could interact and get to know each other more. Hmm. Even like, like dinner or something like picnic that. Picnic dates. Yeah. Horse rides and stuff. Yeah, yeah I actually like horseback riding. Too hard, bro. Riding. Say less. <laughs> I would have been over. I would have took that one. Right? I, I would have been over. Like, honestly, bro, call. I like you. I'm gonna put it like that. You can do it. Out of these two of question, guys, whose balloon are we popping? Balloon is remaining unpopped. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. Um. She got a pop. She don't want to take me, bro. Let's be honest. Sorry. Damn. Okay. I saw it was pretty hard, but why did we end up hobbing him? Oh my god. I like horseback riding. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. That was like the only thing I just. Ah, that's, that's tough. You said I should have said that. I'm sorry. Well, I never rode horse, horses, but I was I would be definitely open to doing things if you, whatever you will want to do. Look, so. look, 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 look. He porked the pig around here, bro. Yeah, you got it. I can't even. For sure. Yeah, she got it. Yeah, she definitely got it, man. Thank you. Damn. All right. She said episode 15. Bring you on up here. Come on up here. What episode she was on? She was on oh, well, he's confident. He's <laughs> confident. Any final questions? Out of here, bro. How soon are you available for a date? Okay. Pretty soon. Okay. <laughs> All right, then. So, is it going to be a yes for you for her? It's hell yeah. I hope it don't work out. Bro. Is it a yes for you for him? We got a man. I'm not clapping. I hope it. I'm clapping for something else. And you guys can go on I hope it don't work out. <laughs> okay, y'all, give it up for them. Give it up. Give it up. <laughs> nah, I'm joking. Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. I ain't gonna lie, the options is terrible. And why she be bad Ooh, too? Welcome in. What's your name? Brianna. Brianna, how mm -hmm. old are you? I'm 32. And what do you do? Um, I work in human resources. Hey, very cool. Uh, Trey, this is like you might as well get this um, one, Trey. For fun, I like to just this the keep last one? my family. I'm a real home body. Seven. It might be, this might be the club, last one. Music, all that. Trey, okay. mm -hmm. uh, no, you gotta lock in, in, bro. Yeah. Can't um, let Timmy take this one. He has to be a hustler. <laughs> he has to be ambitious, passionate, um, driven, that kind of thing. Well, okay. got pretty eyes some deal breakers. Um, um, I don't like somebody you know, who's emotionally you have an unintelligent. Like your eyes like to make um, it, like, I don't like somebody who doesn't stand stand on their own. I think it's pretty old um, And I like a man who is faith driven, whatever that may be. Mm. Okay. All right. So we do have three Trey, guys left. Bro, I know you're the last one. I'm so sorry. But I am going to go ahead and have you ask these guys a question just to help you narrow down, see who's more of your match. Okay. Um, are you faithful right now? And if you are, what is your faith in? Okay. Let's start right here with your name and age and the answer to hey, your question. Hey, faithful, brother. It's the I'm Cedric. I'm 31. Um, I'm a Christian. I don't go to church like that, but I, you know, I do. Like, I take my daughter to children's church sometimes, like in Chandler. Um, but Trey, yeah, bro. like more than that, I'm a Christian, though. Know? Lock this up, Trey. I go to Trey, church when lock I Lock it up, bro. This is for you, bro. Lock this up, bro. Let's go over here with your name and age and the answer to her question. I'm Trey, I'm 29. Um, I don't really have a religion. I just believe in God at the end of the day. But as far as going to church, I haven't been in a while. But I just believe in God. I don't have I don't clarify. Trey, you know, so, clarify is no I religion. mean, you don't want to lie about your religion, but like, bro. Name and age and the answer to her question. Um, Timothy Watch 37. Up, bro. Uh, I claim Christianity. Um, I used to go to a non-denominational non church. Okay. Uh, used to sing and praise and worship. Um... Our options are, are that's, in hell, bro. That's what I claim. <laughs> okay, cool. All right. Let's head on back. Right, you got to keep Trey. Trey, you have this in the okay, back. Okay, I am going to have you pop one of these guys' balloons, just kind of based off of what you've heard, what she you see, whatever it is. One, so let me hand you a pick. Uh, Timmy gave a, a decent answer. There you go. And then just whenever you the first heard. one, bro. <laughs> uh, oh, Timmy, bro. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right, so why did we end up popping him? Um, I just think 
on a like any other basis if i had met you i don't think that i would have like you would have been my type off rip that's crazy she didn't she didn't she pop didn't from something. the answer she popped because timmy's so timmy it's something i would normally go for immediately okay timmy bro you dress for every no, you dress for every event dress. right now that's uh, the thing yeah. bro um but i would i wanted to hear you out mm -hmm. um i'm somewhat attracted to you but it's just i was just trying to get some more information to see where i could fit in possibly and Tim, and, Timmy, um, you can fit in I every, guess every event with what you got. Today's on, not bro. a good day today. <laughs> yeah, it's not a good day because look at your fit, right bro. Oh. <laughs> you got right every now. color on, oh. too. Why aren't you happy right now? Uh, he my boom got popped, that's why. Uh, yeah. Timmy. Like, I'm not happy right now. It's okay. Timmy, bro, you can put this on yourself, bro. Timmy, this dress a little better, bro. Color coordinate right, a little I'm gonna bit. I'm going to have you ask these remaining guys another question. Okay. Um, kids, do you guys have any? If so, how many? Okay. This up, bro. Start over here. Any kids? I got one. She's seven. Do you want more? Um, yes. Okay. I'm down the line one day, hopefully. Okay. Okay. And over here, any kids? Trey, no, lock none. Yeah, lock in. And Trey. do you want some? Yeah. Okay. Right. Now, for yourself, do you have any kids? Yeah, so I have one son. He's seven. Damn! Um, but I don't want any. <laughs> You don't want any more. Okay. Try so, hey, try standing on Bibi, bro. So obviously, you end up popping on the kids. So, is she someone that is your try type? Try standing on Bibi. I respect her. Yes. Okay. Makes her your type. Uh, she's physically attractive. I mean, I think she's goal driven. Um, other than that, hearing what she last said, right. that she didn't want it, definitely would have been the kill to it. I like that. So, is he someone that's your type? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. Trace and what so makes him bro. your type? Um, I feel bro, like his stature. Kids, kids are gonna be kids, um, especially at your age, bro. Most women are gonna have some kids, speech. bro. Thank you. It is what it is, bro. Right. So we do have one guy left. And I understand. Questions Whatever your deal breaker is, um, it's your yes, deal uh, what's your idea of first date? My idea of a first date. Yeah. Um, I'm a foodie, so I like to try different things. I like to go for an experience too, so um, something with a little bit of a mix, new food or something like that, with a nice like vibe. Trey, like, is there any more? No, bro, mm -hmm. she's the last one on a bit. Okay, all right. Yeah, look at the time. Let me bring you on up. We never know. We never know. Let's see here. Right, so, any final have... questions between the two of nah, you before we determine if this is a match? Uh, yes. Uh, like you travel a lot, like. Kind of. So I travel a little My bit most of the time for work hell, is where I travel a lot. Tell and when it's not for work, I do like to travel um, in my free time or just to have fun. So, yeah. Okay. I'm about to sign. Timmy, though. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. Timmy's so Timmy. I hope Timmy don't that, is, is we, it going to be a match for Timmy you? Here, but Timmy, we got to yeah. do better, bro. Okay. And is it a match for you for him? Uh, no. Exactly. <laughs> no. But it's only because... Um, I wouldn't want to deprive you of anything like having more kids or whatever like that. Yeah, yeah, nah, and I'm real. just not on that right now. Nah, for real. She mm -hmm. didn't like her options. We being honest, she wanted yeah. to train. I'll have you head back over there. Yeah, thank you. All right. Well, that is all the balloons popped. We do thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. I'll thank take you. this. Thank you so much. That's it, bro. Thank you, everyone, for tuning yeah. into this episode of Pop the Balloon uh, or Find Love. Hey man, shout out to our left. Shout out to this episode, man. It was a fun one. I hope we can do this more, but our left, bro. Yo, videos be too long, bro. Too long. But I get it. I get it. I get it. It's it's, it's good for content. I get it. I get it. I get it. But uh, if you like this video, don't forget to like, to subscribe, hashtag pray for Timmy in the comments. You feel me? And that's it. Peace.